friends, guess what? It's time! It's time to do Christmas. Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new here. My name is Cheryl. I love decorating my home with style on a budget and I love to try to make my home look a lot more expensive than it really is. So if you love home decorating and you love decorating your home with style on a budget, then this is a channel for you. If by the end of the video you like what you have seen, I would hope you would hit the subscribe button, tap that notification bell and become a member of the iStyle My Style family. Guys, as I said, it's time. It's time to talk about Christmas. So as I sit here today, it is Friday, October the 10th, and I will start decorating for Christmas on the 1st of November. So I wanted to talk to you guys about my theme for Christmas. So last year, I told you guys my theme was going to be black tie. And I know you were thinking, Cheryl, what's black tie? What does that mean? Well, can you get a little hint from my shirt? Yes, maybe. So my black tie theme is going to be very elegant, very modern and sophisticated, and it's going to feature diamonds and pearls. That is my black tie theme. So along with my black and white, we are going to have pearls, as you can see on my shirt. So I wanted to talk to you a little bit about my inspiration. So last year, I did a Christmas decor haul that I picked up from Hobby Lobby. If you missed that video, I will leave it linked in the description box down below. But in that video, I showed you these huge strands of pearls that I found at Hobby Lobby. So those are going to be the theme along with the black and white, along with diamonds. You can never have, you know, diamonds are a girl's best friend. You can never have too many diamonds and pearls. So that is what this year's theme is going to consist of. So let's take a look back at the Christmas decor that I picked up from Hobby Lobby. And then I'll show you some items that I am thinking about. Oh, well, not really thinking about that I have, that I purchased, but it's not yet here. But I want to tell you about it because they won't last long. So let's look back and then I'll be right back. Let's start off the haul with what I picked up from Hobby Lobby with this ornament. Oh my gosh, look how pretty this is. You guys know my theme for next year is black tie and that means it's going to be elegant and very modern and understated. Well, I can't say understated because you know your girl, she's probably going to go over the top with it. but. Yeah, it's gonna be black and white and silver is going to be the primary color next year. So I thought these screamed elegance to me. Look how pretty this is. So, so pretty with the white and the silver. I was only able to find three of these. These were $4.99 and at 66% off, they were like a little over a dollar. I'm sorry, I'm gonna put my glasses on so I can see. Yeah, it's from the Robert Stanley collection. So, so pretty. So that's the first thing that I wanted to show you. The other thing that I picked up, hold on. Okay, so the other thing that I picked up from the Robert Stanley collection that I thought was so, so pretty, and I don't wanna blind you, is these ornaments. Oh my gosh, guys, look how pretty. These are, there's several different shapes in here. There's round and then there's the onion shape and some of them have like little snowflakes on them. So, so pretty. So this was regularly $19.99 at 66% off. So it's like $5. 
and change, which I thought was a really great price. So I picked up two of these. To go along with that, I also picked up these. These are white and some of them have like little iridescent on them. I thought these were really, really nice. These were $12.99 at 66, whoa, at 66% off. These are shatterproof, so it wouldn't matter if I dropped them, but don't want to drop them in any case. But anyway, these were $12.99 and 66% off. I picked up two of those. To go along with those, you guys know, whenever you're decorating the tree, oversized ornaments are the way to go. In the tree, oversized ornaments are the way to go. Not only do they take up a lot of real estate, but they give your tree a very high-end look. So, I picked up these. You know, I, I used a lot of oversized balls this year, especially on my CBT inspired tree. And so when I saw these, these were $14.99 at 66% off. I picked up two packs of these. I think these will look so great in my tree. I'm on the hunt for some larger black ornaments. I'm hoping I can find them. If not, I will pick up an oversized ornament in a color that I don't like in order to spray paint it later to, to get the look that I want. But again, I thought that was a great price. Keeping with items in white, look at these. Oh my gosh, black tie. And what's more black tie than pearls, right? Look at these, oh my gosh. When I showed you these in the store, I absolutely picked them up right away. There was only a few of them left. They were $10.99 at 66% off. So what, around $2 or so? So I had to pick these up and I picked up, I think four or five of these. So, so pretty. I had never seen these at Hobby Lobby before. Leave me a comment down below and let me know if you saw these in your local Hobby Lobby. So, black tie, yes please and thank you. So I picked up four, four or five, maybe six, I don't know. <laughs> but I had to get those. That is everything that I picked up in white. Now we're going to the color for next year, which is silver. Silver, black, and white, I think, look so high-end, so elevated, and I think silver will look perfect in my black tie theme. So, I don't want to just pick up any silver balls. I want to pick up something that is going to catch your eye. It's going to make a statement on the tree. So, when I saw these, again, I don't want to blind you. This is how these look. You can see all of the texture and the ornament. These were normally $9.99 at 66% off. So what, $3, $2 and change. So I went ahead and picked up four boxes of these. I think these will look really nice on the tree. And then also keeping with the silver thing, I went ahead and picked up some of these. I want to see if I can find these in the larger size, but look how pretty these are. They will add so much glitz and luster to the tree next year. Can you see these pictured with some black balls on the tree? I'm so sorry, I don't want to blind you. That would look so, so nice. So I went ahead and picked up these. And guys, the reason that I'm showing these to you today, oh, and by the way, it's Christmas Eve. Happy Merry Christmas Eve. I hope you guys are enjoying time with your friends and family and celebrating the holiday. I had such a nice time visiting with friends and family. And yeah, can't wait to do it all over again tomorrow. But I wanted to show you these because after Christmas, Everybody's going to flock to the store looking for those sales. People are going to flock to the stores looking for those sales so that they can buy for their trees next year. So I'm showing you these, giving you ideas. So if you wanted to know what my black tie theme entails, this is what it is. This is what you're looking at. And then I'll put it all together next year and you'll see how it comes together. But I had to pick these up, so, so nice. Again, um, these were $10.99 if I didn't say, at 66% off. 
and you guys know I love deer. So of course I had to pick up more deer and these I thought just screamed elegance to me. Just very modern, elegant looking ornaments. And these were $8.99 for a pack of three. 66% off. I thought these would look really nice on the tree and I might even tie little black bows around their neck. Black tie. Get it? And so I thought these were really, really cute. So I picked up a couple of packs of those. Also, what's that it? Oh, I think, and again, I apologize for the rustling. So I told you we're going black tie. And as such, I want to have some jewels. So we have our pearls. And where is it? I also want to add in these really pretty gemstones. Look how pretty these are. So I picked up some of these uh, from Hobby Lobby in the past. So I have a few of them already, but these caught my eye and I thought they would look so pretty. Again, black tie, glam, elegant. You can see how the light is picking up on these. And can you see how pretty these will be dangling from the tree? Oh my gosh. So I had to pick up these. I think I picked up six of these. These were $3.99 at 66% off, so less than a dollar. Of course, I had to pick up more than one, so I got those. And then to go along with the theme, again, you know, Jesus is the reason for this season. So I also want to always include something that represents the season, the reason for the season on my tree. And when I saw these pretty angels, oh my gosh, I had to pick them up. Look how pretty she is. Can we get a thumbnail? Look how pretty. Oh my gosh. So she has like a teardrop pendant on her. I also picked up one that has like a diamond pendant for her little skirt. And then another one that has a longer pendant for her skirt. And I thought these would look so, so pretty on the tree. These were, how much were you? $4.99 at 66% off. And whoops, don't wanna drop them. Look how pretty these are. Oh my gosh, these will look so nice on the tree. So I picked up several of those. And then the last thing that I picked up from Hobby Lobby, and I was very surprised to find this, is more of the viral garland. Remember, you guys, I told you about the viral garland. I used it this year in my loft area. It looks so, so pretty, so fabulous. It looks so luxe. So next year, since we're going black tie, I want it to have at least a few more. And so I was able to score two more of these very pretty garlands and at 66% off. So the store that I went to, sorry, um, it's not in a highly populated area. Well, it's in a highly popula populated area. I just don't think people do a lot of decorating. So there was a bunch of stuff, as you could see, still on the shelves. And that is the store I'm thinking about going back to because if that garland is still there at 75%, I paid $35 for, it, for each one. So it's still a little pricey. Um, but it's so worth it because of the quality of the garland. Um, but it's 75% off. Can you imagine? Oh my gosh. So I think I'm going to get up bright and early to see if I can score two more. <laughs> um, and then just get rid of my old scraggly garland because I just really, really love that garland. All right. So that is everything that I picked up from Hobby Lobby. Now we're going to go on to CB2. Hold on. All right, I lied. That's not everything that I picked up from Hobby Lobby. So I forgot about these. So to go again, to go along again with the black tie theme, I picked up this huge box of ornaments. It was $19.98. There are, oh gosh, two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, oh, it's like 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Thirty-six ornaments in here. Oh my gosh! So for $19.99 at 66% off. Yes, please and thank you. So I got this gray and it has a kind of a matte gray, a shinier gray and a silver, like a glitter gray. And I also picked it up in black, again, to go with our black tie theme. Also, what I forgot, is this mercury glass Christmas tree. Oh my gosh, you guys know, I told you I wanted to bring in some mercury glass trees for next year and I was so lucky to find the ones that I got from Pottery Barn. I showed you those in my bedroom, my master bedroom Christmas tour. If you missed that video, I will leave it linked in the description box down below so you can go check it out. Those trees from Pottery Barn are so big, so, so nice. So I got those also on clearance. So now is the time to buy those items from your high-end stores like Pottery Barn, CB2, Our House, Restoration Hardware. I think they used to sell Christmas back in the day, but I don't think they do anymore. Z Gallery, Z Gallery, I looked at their stuff. Wasn't anything I wanted on there. But yeah, I did some damage <laughs> from CB2. But again, with the mercury glass trees, I found these two from Hobby Lobby. They were originally, I think it was like $45 if I'm remembering correctly, but I paid like $14 for them. So cheaper than the Pottery Barn ones, even though they were on clearance. With the Pottery Barn ones are bigger, except for the little baby one, which is so, so cute. Um, but these, again, are very nice size. I wanna say they're about 14 inches tall. And at $14, it's still giving us the luxe look for less. I am definitely loving them. All right, guys, so you can see I got a bunch of really fabulous things from Hobby Lobby. Hobby Lobby has the same ornaments just about every year. So if you want to decorate your home in a black tie theme like me this year, then run to Hobby Lobby and pick up those items. You can pick them up for 50% off. Even though I got mine on clearance, I want to say it was like 75% off last year. You can go pick up your items now. Run because they probably will not last long. So... To go along with those things, I also found these really pretty flocked black ornaments from Target. Oh my gosh, guys, they are from the Wonder Shop. They are so, so pretty. I will put up the photo here so you can see how they look. And right now it's Target Circle Week, so you can get them for $7, guys. $7, they're normally $10. So if you wanna create a very, glam, elegant, sophisticated, black tie theme for Christmas this year like me, make sure you pick up these ornaments from Hobby Lobby. Also, I was watching Rebecca Robeson. Oh guys, Rebecca Robeson always goes over the top with her Christmas decor and she did a Christmas ornament unboxing and she showed some like really pretty, really fancy ornaments that you can get from Amber Interiors, I think, or Amber & Co. That's what it is, Amber & Co. And I decided there was one ornament that I had to have. I looked for a dupe, I couldn't find it. So I went ahead and ordered it from Amber & Co. And it's these long crystal ornaments and I absolutely love them. Yes, they are a little pricey, but I think they will look absolutely fabulous on our tree. Now, some of the other ornaments she showed, she's doing like a ski theme, I'm not doing that, but she really had some really nice, modern and sophisticated ornaments. And a lot of the ornaments she showed, I already have. So I, every year I go to Target, TJ Maxx and Hongas looking for after Christmas clearance. And I showed you these really nice, really, really nice ornaments. I think they're from Christian Siriano that I picked up on clearance that are very similar to the ornaments that she has. So my advice to you would be go out right now because Home Goods, Marshalls, TJ Maxx, they all have their Christmas decor out and you can find those same types of ornaments, but for a lot less. For those one of a kind type ornaments, 
like the long little um, clear glass iridescent ornament that I showed you earlier. Yeah, you probably won't be able to find that. So yes, you'll have to go, you'll have to bite the bullet and buy those from Amber and Company. But the other ones, guys, be on the hunt for your Marshalls, Home Goods, and TJ Maxx. And on that note, also, I wanted to show with you, share with you some things that I picked up in past Christmases that I have that we are also going to be using. So again, diamonds and pearls are the theme, the black tie theme. And I picked these up, I wanna say three or four years ago from Home Goods, and they were just $4. So I have four of these, and these will be coming out in my Christmas totes. I'm going to start bringing those out. Along with that, I went to Amazon and I wanted to find some diamond and pearl um, little garlands that I can use along with my greenery, my gar to go along with the greenery on my garland. You remember last year in the loft, I had the viral Hobby Lobby garland and I had this crystal little jewel um, garland that I put on and I had this little crystal, this round crystal garland that I used in that um, on my fireplace last year. So I'm going to be using that again. I'm on the hunt for some more of that, but I also want to find something with pearls. And guys, look, look at these. Oh, so nice. So let me get up close so you can see the pearls and the diamonds. Again, it looks, looks like little ice chips. So I think these will really be really, really pretty. And that garland that we picked up from Hobby Lobby. This, I think it was like $12. And I think you get like six or eight strands of these. So I think these would be really, really pretty in the garland. Again, diamond and pearl, black tie. Can you see it? Also, to go along with the uh, black tie theme, last year Target had these really pretty ornaments and this is what they look like. Oh, so, so pretty. So I picked up several of these and I just tied a black ribbon around it to give it a more sophisticated look. So again, very, very nice. And I, I don't know if they're gonna have these again this year. Um, I've seen people go to Target, but I don't, I don't think they've shown these. So if they are still available, I will leave them linked down in the description box below. But look how pretty these are. Again, black tie. All right, and then to go along with that, to elevate the look even more, we're gonna be using some florals. And what better than white roses? You guys know I love white roses. I decorate with them year round. And these black peonies. So I thought these would be really, really pretty to decorate with. And to go along with that, we also have to have our crystal. So this is a piece that I picked up while thrifting. I'm gonna say it was around $5, but just look how nice it would look with the florals, guys. So, so pretty. Again, our black tie theme. Can you see it? So glam, so sophisticated, so elegant. I cannot wait to start decorating. Also, I found some really unique chargers from Amazon. These are so, so pretty, guys. And they look like this. Oh my gosh, so, so nice. This will look really nice on our black tie theme table. Again, with a blind... Again, with the diamonds, with, again, with the diamond and the pearl and the crystal. Can you see it? I can turn this around. So, so nice. Look how nice that is going to be. So there is that. Also, I found these really nice ornaments on, I think it was TJ Maxx. TJ Maxx online, and it's these really long icicle ornaments. Oh my gosh, guys, they were very affordable. You could probably find them in stores, but I didn't want to take the chance that I wouldn't be able to, so I did order them online, and I will put them up here, and I will leave them also linked in the description box in case you were interested. Also, I found these really pretty black and white placemats. I debated, Cheryl, 
you don't need those. And I'm thinking, yes, but they're beaded and they're so pretty. And you know, they would look really nice with our black tie thing. But Cheryl, you don't need them. I know, but they're so pretty. So yeah, I got them. And I'll put up the photo here and they are on the way and I cannot wait to get them again. I am just so excited for this black tie theme. I see it in my head. I cannot wait for it to come together. I hope you guys are as excited as I am. If so, please make sure to give the video a big thumbs up, share it with your friends, leave me a comment down below and let me know, are you going to have a black tie theme? Are you going to join me in our black tie theme this year? I hope so. So then another thing I decided to get to go along with the black tie theme. This one I saw when I was perusing interest, interest. This one I saw when I was perusing Pinterest to get some inspiration. So I saw these and they were like really, really expensive. And I'm thinking, you know what? Let me look for a dupe. So you know what I love to do? I went to my Google lens and I Googled it and I found them on Shein. And it's these really nice pillow covers. Look how nice these are. They have like the little puffy detail. So, so elegant, so black tie. And I had to go ahead and pick these up. These were very affordable from Shein. I think they were like five or $6. So make sure you go pick these up. I wanna say this is probably a 20 by 20. And they also come in an 18 by 18. They also have white. So I did get the 20 by 20 in the black and I got the 18 by 18 in white. But as you can see, it's like an ivory white. It's not a true white. So I don't know that we will be using these. You can tell from my collar that it is a more ivory white. So I don't know. But anyway, the black, I absolutely love. So sophisticated, so modern. So that is the theme. Now, we are going to use, I, I bought a, what I call a black frost Christmas tree from Walmart. Um, I wanna say two or three years ago, I decorated it in some DIY ornaments, again, that was similar to ornaments that Rebecca Robeson had showed, but again, I was doing it in a budget-friendly way. If you missed that video, I will leave that linked in the description box down below too, where we made our own ornaments, but, I'll say all that to say is we're going to have a blacked out tree. You guys know how I blacked out my living room for fall? Well, we're going to have a blacked out Christmas tree as well. Again, to go along with my black tie theme, along with our diamonds and pearls, but it's going to be blacked out. So we're gonna use black ornaments and different textures. We're gonna use those felt ornaments. We're gonna use a, it's a, ribbed black ornament. Um, there's one that has like a geometric pattern to it. Um, it's going to be so, so pretty. And then I'm going to add like little burnished um, ornaments with a little hint of like a brassy gold. I just think that would look so pretty. And here, I'll put up the inspiration photo here. And guys, I cannot wait to put it all together. So I think that is everything that I had to show you today. Um, is that everything? I think that's everything. I do have some glasses that I showed you guys to go along. All right, so you know I love to decorate and I want, and I try to make everything as budget friendly as I can. And you know, one of the ways I do that is by going thrifting. So with this black tie theme, I showed you the chargers, but we are going to be using thrifted plates. So you can find some really nice china from the thrift store. This one is white and it has the silver detail. And then this is the little spread plate. These are two different plates, but you can never tell. And I had these plates, I thrifted them a long while ago, and I used to use them a lot in my tablescapes, but guys, this is how the place setting is going to look. You can see that it's going to look oh so nice. Look how nice that is going to look. Very elegant. And then these chargers that were like six, I wanna say they're for like 
$25, $25 or $30, you know, Amazon pricing fluctuates, but look how nice that's going to be. So to go along with that, I also thrifted years ago, these really nice goblets. Look how nice these are. These I also used in my tablescapes in the past. So, so pretty. Can you see it? My black tie theme. Can you picture it in your head? I bet you can. So that is the direction for this year's Christmas. I am so excited. I cannot wait to start decorating. I hope today's video has inspired you in your Christmas decorating as well. I know I see a lot of, of people on YouTube. They show like, I think, I guess it's like a modern organic or um, I don't know, a rustic organic Christmas. That's not me. And I know it's not everybody. So everyone has to decorate in their own style, their own taste. And this is my taste. This is what I like. And I know you guys that are part of the family love it as well. So I hope it has inspired you. So this Christmas, we're going to try to use things that we can find thrifting and for those things that we can't we're going to find them in the most budget friendly way possible and we're going to use things that we already have if you're like me you have a lot of this home decor already if you love decorating in black and white like me you already have a lot of black and white ornaments I have those really nice black and white ornaments that I picked up from Hobby Lobby several years ago those are going to come back out I am going to be using pearl ornaments as well and larger black and white ornaments to pull my theme all together. So last year or every year, I try to incorporate something whimsical for my grandbabies. Well, this year there won't be a whimsical tree. Everything is going to be in a modern and sophisticated palette. So if you love that and you're looking for inspiration, this is the channel for you. Make sure you hit that subscribe button because come November 1st, we are gonna start decorating and I know you're absolutely gonna love it. So leave me a comment down below. Let me know your thoughts. And with that, my friends, I hope to see you in the next one. Bye-bye guys.